Hi, welcome to the Zara Core Learning Coach by Example. And my name is Chien. Today is the day 15. I would like to talk about how to read the data inside a text file in Java and using the scanner class. Okay, so here in the previous video, I already done a video and I write you how to read the text file in Java using the buffer reader. And today, when we are going to use the scanner class for demonstration. Okay, so now let's get started. Okay, so here I will close this one. And here I will create a new class inside the main package. And I will name it e read data text file using uh, scanner. Okay, so we have to regenerate a static method. Okay, so here, uh, in the D drive, we have a text file named e, the name that e, uh, um, that dot txt file, and inside this file we have some the messages. Hello everyone, I'm Chien Glad to meet you guys, thank you for watching. Okay, so here, I will go ahead to write the code to, to read the data inside that file and display it into the console window here. Okay, so here, in order to use the, uh, the scanner class, we have to input the, the library which support for the scanner. Okay, firstly, we have to use, import the java.io. java.io dot file and java import those until those scanner ok cool so now here we are going to write the code inside the main method file file new file and we have to provide the path of the TT file. It is inside the D drive slash slash test dot txt. Okay. So here we go ahead to create new 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 instance for the scanner. New scanner with the parameter in the file. For instance, here it is displayed in some the error messages. So you have to click on this one. But fully, you have to hover it and see the message. And you can see here it said we didn't handle any 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 messages. For example, the file not found exception. Okay, here. So we click on this one and we have to. We have to add a new jacket block to handle this one. What is this? Okay. What is this? Save it. And after that, when we when we have a, an instance of scanner, we are reading the data from the that dot txt file. So we have to using the loop to 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 loop all of the line of code. I mean the paragraph in the text file, and after that display it on the console window. Okay. So here I will go. You I will go ahead to using the while looping. Uh, scanner dot hat night line. I will print out system dot out dot print line and the parameter is the scanner scanner dot next line oh. we should change the name let's see no needs, okay. No needs. Nice. 
So now here, try to run this application. Yeah. So here, after you try to run this application, so it will display the message in the console window. Hello, one. I'm here. Glad to meet you. Thank you for watching. Okay. So that means here, uh, after we you execute this uh this application, so it will read all of the in, uh, the text information inside that text file and display it in the the console window. Okay. So here, I just hope this video will have fun for you. And actually, this video, it looks like the same, th same thing the day 14. We are using the buffer reader to, 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 to read the data from the text file. And of course, we have uh, so many ways to read the data from the text file and display it on, in the uh, console app. Okay, I hope this video will have fun for you. And let me know if you see any issue. Bye-bye and see you later.